sunshines, it's Christy and this is Milo and welcome back to my channel or if you happen to be stopping by, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. So for today's video, we are going to be doing a battle of the clothing subscription boxes. I feel like I need my best WrestleMania announcer's voice for that section. Anyway, yesterday my Trendsend and my Stitch Fix hit my doorstep and I thought it would be fun to open them both in one video and see who comes on top. I opened my mailbox last night and my Rocks box actually got here too. So we'll just check that out and see what's inside. You guys seem to like mega unboxing, so I thought we would do like a clothing edition type of thing. We're gonna go ahead and dive in. If you have not already hit that subscribe button, what are you waiting for? We are a fun channel, it is totally free, and I would love to have you as part of my Georgia Sunshine family. So if you like positivity, if you like tons of clothing, fashion, hauls, unboxings, with a little bit of lifestyle thrown in, then I'm the channel for you. So hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the notification bell also so you can be notified when I upload new videos and we are going to dive right in. All right, so I'm gonna put these down. I'm gonna thud because I'm just gonna drop them and we'll just open the Rocks box really quickly. I'm gonna give you the 30 second rundown with Rocks box because I've done it on my channel a million times. You sign up, it's a $21 styling fee. They send you three pieces of jewelry from your wish list and there's probably thousands of pieces on Rocks box. It's all like mid-price jewelry, like Kate Spade and things like that. And um, they'll send you an email that says, these are the three pieces we're gonna send you. You have 24 hours to accept them or you can switch out what's going to come in your box. Then you can either buy the pieces inside, one, two, or all three. If you buy anything, they credit that $21 to your first piece. Or you can just wear the pieces and then send them back. You just send them back in this envelope postage paid. So it's really, really great. I do not use it as a rental service. I am a jewelry girl, so I use it to kind of build my jewelry wardrobe. I like to have classic jewelry pieces, but it's also fun. You know, clothing and jewelry both have trends that sort of happen, so it's nice to keep up with the jewelry trends too. I do have a discount code. Well, it's not really a discount code. It's actually gonna give you um, your first box with no styling fee so they won't charge you the $21 but if you check out and buy any of the pieces they will give you the $21 credit which is kind of nice so you can kind of try it and get a discount if you like anything so I have three pieces here do I have a card in here oh they changed it it's now on the back okay so here are the pieces that I picked um, this is pink. I have a couple of pink pieces in my wardrobe now and I wanted just a, a cute little um, nod to that color. So when I saw this stone, I thought it was so pretty. It's really a light pink and it's got a built-in um, layering piece and then it's got a long extender. So this would be great with cardigans and things if you want to make it longer or shorter. That's beautiful. I love that piece. Also with Rocks box, if you buy, I'm looking for my glasses. I don't think I brought them over here. All over the place today. Oh yeah, here they are. If you buy all three pieces, you will get an extra $10 off, which is really nice. Okay, so it says that that piece is the Rowan layered necklace. It's by Aster and it's $46. It would normally be 55 if you were buying it in the store. Love that necklace. Okay, then we got this one. This one I liked, I hearted that I wanted it, but I couldn't really tell from the picture if what it was. It was hard to tell. Sometimes jewelry is hard to tell. So this is more of a choker style. That's beautiful also. That's really pretty. Oh gosh, I really like that. All right, let's see how much that one was. You know what? I lied. The... The first necklace that I showed you was only $42. They're both by Aster. This one is $46. And then I got a pair of earrings, which I'm excited about these earrings because I love a good hoop. Actually, I thought they were gonna be bigger. Okay, these are okay, hold on. That's what I'm saying. Sometimes when you look at the jewelry, it's kind of hard to tell. A lot of times they have people wearing the pieces. Now I do like these. I was just thinking that they were gonna be a little bit bigger. Those are really simple kind of links and those earrings are also $42 and they are by Slate. So if you wanna try Rocks Box, I will leave my link down below and let's go ahead and dive into the box. So I have Stitch Fix on the top. So that is the one that we are gonna go ahead and open first. Um, I didn't really ask my stylist for much. She's been doing a pretty good job. They've been doing these previews where you can preview um, 
some of the items that you're going to put in the box and then you can tell them if you like something or not and i think that's really really helping um so here is the postage paid envelope if you don't know about stitch fix it's a clothing subscription box you pay a 20 dollars styling fee your you fill out a profile and your stylist will send you five pieces if you buy anything in the box you get the 20 dollars styling fee credited back or if you buy all five pieces you get a 25 percent discount okay stitch fix is also doing this thing where you can actually go over and buy any of the pieces so anything that i try on i can link down below for you so you can just click on the link and hop over there and grab anything you want that is a referral link just fyi so it says happy fix day christy i hope you're doing well and thank you again for previewing the pieces let's kick things off with the black pistola boot cut jeans oh i got black boot cut jeans i don't have those I kept in mind that you're all stocked up on skinny jeans and these classic bootcut ones will be a nice addition to your closet. Bring these jeans alive by styling them with the white Market and Spruce pullover and reach for your favorite white sneakers for the perfect casual chic ensemble. Uh, spruce things up for any Turkey Day festivities with this black Daniel Rain dress and be sure to add the Nakamole earrings for a fun statement piece. Layla. Okay, perfect. Let's look at the prices. I don't, I'm not really wearing many dresses right now. Um, so the prices are pretty good. There's two things in the $40 range, a 60, a 70, and an 80. So not the cheapest one, but actually not the most expensive one I've ever received either. So here we go. Now again, here is my issue with <laughs> Stitch Fix. I just bought a pink cardigan, which I'm in love with, a light pink cardigan, in my last Stitch Fix, and they sent another light pink sweater of some kind. They did that with me three Stitch three fixes in a row with different rust pieces so it is what it is i am loving this like i mentioned with the jewelry so this is just a classic sweater very very soft this is by market and spruce really cute i just have to wear like brighter makeup when i wear pink um, it says that that is the Market and Spruce Whistler V-neck rib stitched sweater. Wow, it's only $44. That's nice. Okay, I dropped something. And these must be the Nakamole earrings or, oh, holy cow. Wow. Okay, now I'm not saying wow like bad. These are just not what I expected. <laughs> and these are super heavy. They're very, very fun. And if they were light, I think I would probably snap them up because y'all know I love a good earring moment, but these are so heavy. This is like wire that's like coiled around. I think that's why they're, they're so heavy. Wow. So these are gonna be a no. I don't think I'm gonna try these on. I'm gonna leave them nice for the next person. Um, those are... The Alexis Chandelier Statement Earrings for $48. I would have to love them for $48. So those are going to be, like I said, a no. All right, here's the little Daniel Rain. Oh, this is cute. Little dress. This is very fall. Yeah, if you were going somewhere for Thanksgiving or you wanted to dress up a little bit. This looks like a little bit short for me. I tend to like my dresses to go to my knees. But I do like this pattern. It's very pretty. It's just got a little elastic waist. This would be cute with tall black boots. Okay, we'll see what we think of that guy. That is $78. All right. Then we have this little Market and Spruce sweater. This is cute. Nice and long. I have something kind of similar to this already. It's more gray than it is black. It's a little bit heavier knit. It's not the softest, which isn't a bad thing. Like not every sweater has to be soft. Sometimes the softest sweaters I think tend to pill and stuff. Um, that's a Tawny Cotton Blend sweater in white for $68. And then the last thing we got are the boot cut jeans in black. These are by Pistola. I think these are like $88. Yeah, $88. These are the Haley High Rise. And I have to go get a couple pairs of my bootcut jeans altered. My alterations people that I've used for years left 
during COVID. And so I just found another place. I'm taking everything this week. So we'll see if those fit. That's perfect timing. All right, now let's see what Trendsend has to offer. I have to say a bunch of you after my last Trendsend um, suggested that I switch to the warehouse stylist rather than a store stylist because I wasn't having the best luck. And so I did get a box and I did not show it, not because um, I didn't like it. I didn't know what was in it. I just didn't have a spot on the channel last month to do it, but I was not impressed with it. The colors were definitely not me. I don't, I just wasn't impressed. So this is my second one with the warehouse styling me and we'll see what we think. If you want to try Trendsend, I do have a link that's going to give you 20% off anything you buy from your first box. And let's see, I have Margaret B is my stylist. And they usually send you at least three outfits worth of clothing. This says six outfits. One, two, three, four, five, six. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. There's gonna be 13 items in this box. So I do love that because the more items you get in a box, the better chance you have of finding something that you're really going to like. Um, so let's see. I don't know with the warehouse if they're going to send as many sale items, which is one of the reasons that I like shopping in the store because if something gets marked down, we get the, the option of that and probably the warehouse has all the sale stuff already pushed out to the stores. Same thing with Transcend or as Stitch Fix. You can put anything back in this bag that you don't like or don't want and send it right back. So everything comes with a bunch of little bundles in outfits. Okay, so let's see what this one is. Okay, so it says another great weekend outfit features these great finds. Oh, from our sale section. So there is some stuff here on sale. Just add a sneaker. Now this is interesting. There's no prices. They used to put the prices on here. So I guess you have to go look them up. I will try and put the prices um, maybe on the screen for you so you'll know. Okay, so this is a Suburban Riot tee. This is very cute. It says kindness right here. Love that, love that. Very, very cute. I like Suburban Riot. I always say though, they shrink in length just a little bit. So size up if you get one of these. And then here are, oh my gosh, a little camo jogger. I am here for this moment. I am here, please fit for this moment. And these are by Z Supply, which I love. Okay, so that was outfit number one, like it. Here's outfit number two. Lots of black and gray. That's what happened with my last one was there wasn't a lot of color. And so I did ask for more color. Big T and cardigan for another easy look. Is that right? One, uh, no, I don't think so. I don't know. We're just going to open it. I'm not going to worry about the, the outfits. So this is like what I call a grandpa sweater, a Mr. Rogers sweater. It's got a little balloon sleeve. It's a little shorter, so it's a little dressier. Very, very, very cute. I call this a grandpa sweater because after my grandpa died, I found in his closet two sweaters like this. Obviously his were longer and they're up in my closet right now. I just, I just love them. They remind me of him. So this is kind of fun. Now this has a price tag of $98 on it. I don't know if that's on sale or not, so we'll have to see. Okay, the next thing, gosh, they sent lots of black, didn't they? They sent is, oh, a long dress. So just a long black dress. Got a tiny little V-neck. It's high-waisted and it's got a little bit of a ruffle. Hmm. Not sure that I love, love this. This is by Z Supply. This is on sale, it's marked down for the second or third time, it looks like it's $49.99. And I always say with um, Trunk Club or Trendsend, sorry, my mind is gone today. With Trendsend is go over and look at the prices on Ever Eve because that's where all of the clothing is from. And if it's marked down cheaper than the label, you can just email them and they will lower the price for you. And I find that happens, I don't know, a couple times a year. All right, the next thing. Can't open it. Is this light pink hooded sweater? Pink is like the color this year. Again, this is a heavier sweater. It's not super soft. It's a little bit distressed at the bottom. You see? 
Got the hood and the little drawstring. This is by 525. It says that this one is marked down to $54.99. Mm, it's really pretty, really pretty. I'm loving pink this year. Okay, and then I got some high rise Reese cut from the cloth ankle straight leg jeans. And these are cropped, which is good. It's all about showing the booty this year. So the crop jeans are really popular. These are pretty. These are probably like $88, $89. Okay, perfect. Gosh, we got a lot in here. I don't think we got as many things as it says on the um, card. I think they mixed and matched things to make different outfits. Oh, oh, I already own these. Okay, never mind. I thought these were something else. Are these Spanx? Yeah, these are the Spanx faux leather leggings. I actually already own these. If you don't own a pair of these, they are, they are pretty cool. They're pretty fun. Um, they do suck you in almost painfully sometimes. <laughs> so just be prepared if you want to look skinny and you want to be like sucked in within an inch of your life, those are the pants for you. They also look very, very hip and cool. Okay, and then we got just a long tunic by Sanctuary. It's big and oversized. I don't know. That's the look this year is big and oversized. I'm kind of ready for some more not bodycon, but a little, a little less oversized, if you know what I mean. Um, okay, so those were my two boxes. I did have things that I liked from both of them, but let's go ahead and do a try on and see what we think. Hang on. All right, I thought I would add a segment into all of my clothing unboxings where I do like an outfit of the day. I kind of show you my full outfit. So this is a cute sweater from Vince Camuto. I like it so much that I actually bought it in another color. It comes in a bunch of different colorways. I bought it in a green with dark gray sleeves. So cute, super affordable. Then I got these Good American jeans. These are their Good Leg Skinnies, which I think look really pretty on. I have my Steve Madden little flats. Love these things. Like I want them in every color. And then um, I have my little Tor Tory Burch pearl earrings. And then this is the Rebecca necklace from Ana Luisa, which is having a sale right now for 20% off. So I will link all this down below and let's go ahead and do the try on, hang on. All right, I figured since we opened Stitch Fix first, we would try on Trendsend first. These joggers are not going back in the box. There is no way know how and i'm praying that they are on sale they are the cutest little camo soft pants they actually cuff just a little bit at the bottom so you can roll them up or roll them down which is nice because if you're a little bit taller sometimes joggers you have a hard time with them um, being long enough and these are actually long enough on me i'm five seven with them cuffed y'all these are so good <laughs> so good they have pockets they have a little drawstring, really easy. You can put a gray t-shirt, a white t-shirt, any kind of sweatshirt over it and you're good to go. This little t-shirt's adorable. I do need to go up one size because um, I just know these shrink. But I love the little kindness right here. Isn't that sweet? So I think if I can get this shirt in another size, I'm gonna keep this entire outfit. Really adorable. Okay, we're two for two so far, let's keep going. All right, the next outfit are the faux leather Spanx leggings and this really cute tunic. I didn't think I was gonna like this tunic and I love it and the price is pretty good for this one too. It's nice and oversized. It's long enough to cover your booty. I don't usually like when there's a long slit like this, but these are this one's nice. It's done well. The faux leather leggings go up past your belly button and let me show you guys, this is not my stomach. Okay, my stomach is not, you know my cinnamon. <laughs> It sucks you in. And what's great about these two are they lift your butt. So my butt's not this good either, but they just help kind of lift it, creates the illusion that you're all sucked in and lifted and toned and <laughs> they're kind of magical. I have these in the plain black and in the camo, um, both in the faux leather. The camo isn't really um, in your face. It's very subtle until you get right on them but it kind of gives any outfit just a little bit of edge and a little bit of polish. These are both really cute because I already own the leggings. I think I got them from Trendsend actually. I'm not gonna get those, but I do really like this tunic. Okay, let's keep going. 
All right, so here's that little black dress that's been marked down a couple of times. It's got a cute little V-neck. It's got long sleeves, which I kind of love that about it. It's got an empire waist and it's big. It's very big. It's meant to be flowy and comfortable. I will say comfortable is your word. I think if you were a teacher, you could put a little denim jacket over this and you would be so cute and so comfortable all day. Um, it's got two little layers, like there's a layer here, there's a stitch here, and then it also has like a little stitch here. So it kind of gives it that little bell look. I don't like it by itself, but again, put a cute little jeans jacket or, or a little like, maybe a little camo jacket or some kind of field jacket over it. And I think you could style it and make it cute. It looks a little bit heavy just by itself. I think you have to, you'd have to zhuzh it up just a little bit, but the price is definitely right on it. It's a cute black dress. It's not my black dress. So we're gonna keep moving. All right, so next we have this little pink pullover sweater. It's heavy. It's like you can kind of feel the weight of it when it's on you. It is distressed around the bottom. It's oversized, so you can kind of just barely see my fingertips. <laughs> um, and it's not really one that you can pull up. They're gonna pretty much fall down pretty quickly because it's not a, a good cuff. You know what I'm saying? So it's just gonna kind of be floppy unless your arms are pretty long. I think it's okay, but um, between this one and maybe that Stitch Fix pink one, I think I would tend to move toward the Stitch Fix one. It's cute with the little hood. And then here are the Amy straight legged cut from the cloths. You cannot go wrong with cut from the cloths. They just fit a woman's body really nicely. Um, they're not too tight through the hips and the thighs. They go straight down. This is a raw edge hem. You could put little booties with it. Again, little sneakers. So both of these pieces are fine, but I don't need um, the jeans. I actually think I might own these exact same jeans. And I don't know. I think the pullover is fine, but I'm not in love. So I think we only have one more sweater, hang on. Okay, here's the surprise in the box. I wasn't sure what to think about this. This sweater is adorable. I think it would be gorgeous paired with like some wine colored dress pants, black colored dress pants, anything for the office. It's got the little bit of the balloon sleeve which kind of comes over the tight cuff. I love that detail this year. So it gives it a little bit of a dressier look, but I think if you just paired this with black skinny jeans, it's adorable too. Now I just put on a black tank top that was in my closet um, under it. But I think this, if you needed something more business casual to wear to the office, like I said, paired with a darker jean um, and a booty or with a dress pant, I think you could get away with both. This is a beautiful, it's cut beautifully. It fits really well. I love Sanctuary as a brand. That's one thing that I will say about Trendsend. I do feel like this box wasn't necessarily styled towards me. It feels like it's more like styled for the masses. However, they did put a lot of my favorite brands in here. So that makes me think that maybe they do look at my profile because I love Sanctuary. I love the way it fits on my body and I love Z Supply. This is really pretty. I don't know if it's coming across on camera as beautiful. And I wonder if it comes in other colors. It's just really like a good classic piece that I think you would have for years. Even though the balloon is kind of a trendier piece, I don't think that it's something that's gonna show date for a while. I really like the sweater. Okay, so I think Trenton did a pretty good job. Not 13 pieces, like I said, I think when I counted, I think they mixed and matched to make different outfits, um, which was totally fine. Let's go over and see what we think of the stitch. All right, so here is the first outfit. I have this really cute sweater on. Um, I like it, but I don't love it. I think it's perfectly lovely. It's a little bit longer if you're looking for longer. One of the first things I noticed are the stripes match up on the arms, which is fabulous. Um, I don't know. I just, it doesn't make me scream like you need it in your closet. So I think this is gonna be a no, it's beautiful. It's just not making me in love, you know? And then here are the Pistola jeans. Wow, these are nice. Um, these are the boot cuts. Now I just put a shorter booty on with them. These are my Yale, y'all. 
you were holding out on me on the Yale <laughs> booties. Um, what brand are these? I can't remember now. I'll have to look. And so many of you in the comments of that trunk club were like, I've had Yale booties for years. They last. These are the softest boot I've ever put on my feet. And they're like the first booty I haven't ever had to break in. I'm in love with them. But these are a little bit of shorter booty. And I wanted to show you how long the um, boot cut jeans are. Boot cut jeans are supposed to be long. They're supposed to elongate your leg. Um, but these are like super long. So I am going to have to tailor them a little bit. And that's like the trick is you, you have to figure out what shoe you're going to wear consistently with them. Are you going to always wear a heeled shoe? Or are you always going to wear a flat shoe <laughs> to kind of figure out where you want them, them tailored? But they're really, really comfortable. I have a couple of pairs of boot cuts, but I don't have black. I think they're really fun. Okay, I like I like these, but I don't like the sweater. Okay, let's try on that pink sweater. All right, here is the little pink sweater, which I think is pretty. I did just buy that pink cardigan for my last Stitch Fix. The difference is I think the color was a tiny bit more saturated, and because it's a cardigan, I could wear like a different color under it to kind of brighten me up. I think this particular hue, um, isn't bad if I have bright makeup on, but I think I could do with another color, maybe a blue or a green, um, even a black I really like. Um, so I don't know. I love the fit of it. It's kind of ribbed in the middle and then it's a solid sweater down the sleeves, but it's not making me go gaga. So this is going to be a no to. Lastly, I have on a little dress. I'm interested to see what we think of that. Hang on. Okay. So here is the last piece. It's the little dress, which is really cute. I love the pattern. Y'all know I'm not a big floral girl, but I really like the floral pattern on here. It's like so per ugly at chic. Does that make sense? I don't think it's like the prettiest pattern, but put together, I don't know. I think I'm digging myself in a hole. I like the pattern. Um, but again, I just like my dresses to be a little bit longer and that's fine. Um, you could obviously do tights with it or whatever you wanted, tall boots. Um, but for me personally, I just like my dresses a little bit longer. I think they just look a little bit better on my body. This has got an elastic waist, which is really nice. It actually sits where I would like it to sit, which is good too. I think it's a good dress. She's not my dress. Okay, stay tuned and I will be back for the recap. Hang on. All right, you guys, I was so curious about these earrings. They're very me. They're very fun. And I thought, you know what? Maybe one earring would not be as heavy like on the ear as they feel like on the card. Y'all, these are crazy heavy. These were on my ears for about a minute and my ear is crying out in relief right now. Um, so these are going to be a no as much as I love them. I just can't handle them. I'm going to put my regular earring back in. Um, in terms of the battle of the boxes, I personally think for this one, Transcend one, let me know what you think. I loved the little camo jogger pants. I'm going to grab those, maybe the kindness tee if I can size up. And then I really liked that tunic. In terms of stitch fix, I'm kind of on the fence about the black bootcut jeans. I have black jeans in my wardrobe. Do I really need a pair of bootcut ones considering they're $88 and I'm going to have to get them tailored? I'm not really sure. I think I might live with what I already have. Do you think that they have a place in my closet? Let me know below. I will link everything if you want to try Roxbox, if you want to try Stitch Fix, if you want to try Trendsend, and I will link all of the clothing for both boxes and the um, jewelry down below in case you're interested. Hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you soon for another one. Bye-bye.